European exploration. In the late 15th century, Europeans set out on a remarkable series of overseas journeys. What caused them to undertake such dangerous voyages to the ends of the earth? In medieval Europe, demand for spices and other luxury goods from Asia was greater than the supply. So merchants were able to charge high prices and thus make great profits. These goods were brought by many traders who all resold the items at increased prices. Paying such high prices to the numerous middlemen severely cut into their profits. So Western merchants sought to bypass the Asian and Italian traders by finding a sea route directly to Asia. Europeans were also motivated to explore by the desire to spread Christianity. European countries believed they had a sacred duty to convert non-Christians throughout the world. While business and religion were the primary incentives for exploration, advances in technology made the voyages of discovery possible. In the 1400s, shipbuilders designed a new sturdy vessel, the caravel. In addition, triangular sails adopted from the Arabs allowed it to sail effectively against the wind. The use of different navigational tools such as the astrolabe and the magnetic compass enabled sailors to better determine their location at sea. Portugal took the lead in overseas exploration when Prince Henry the Navigator founded a navigation school in 1419. Mapmakers, shipbuilders, scientists, and sea captains gathered there to perfect their trade and share the knowledge acquired by sailors. Within several years, Portuguese ships began sailing down the western coast of Africa. They established a series of trading posts along the way. In 1488, Portuguese captain Bartolomeu Dias reached the southern tip of Africa, which later was named the Cape of Good Hope. In 1498, Portuguese explorer Vasco da Gama finally sailed around the Cape of Good Hope and reached the port of Calicut, or Corrigor, in India. The first European sailors filled their ships with spices and sold their cargo with a 6,000% profit. This voyage gave Europe a direct sea route to India. As the Portuguese were pushing towards India, the newly born Spanish monarchy also desired a direct sea route to Asia. Then an Italian captain, Christopher Columbus, showed up in Spain and convinced the Spanish royal couple, Ferdinand and Isabella, that the earth was round and that he could reach Asia by sailing west. In 1492, Columbus set off to sail west across the Atlantic Ocean. After a two-month voyage, Columbus reached Hispaniola in the Caribbean. Believing that he was in India, he called the Native Americans Indians. He never realized that he had discovered a new continent, but his voyage would open the way for the European colonization of the Americas, a process that would forever change the world.